the healthcare field goes well beyond the work of doctors and nurses. There are a wide variety of jobs and programs for people wanting to get into the field. And as Delane Cleveland reports in today's Health Check, an event at North Hennepin Community College aimed to showcase some of the healthcare job opportunities. We're very excited that everyone is here and that is such a good turnout. Selecting a field of study isn't always the easiest thing to do in college. I don't know. That's the problem. I have been trying to figure that out. Just ask some of the students at North Hennepin Community College. Probably like nutrition or something. To help solve that problem, North Hennepin organized this health showcase to promote the different programs they offer and highlight various healthcare careers. The goal is to learn about our varied programs that we offer through the Division of Health Sciences, Wellness and Human Services, but also to give them tools to be healthy. So we have a health department, exercise science, nursing. One of the more popular but not very well-known programs at North Hennepin is in medical laboratory technology. We work in the laboratory running tests on blood and body fluids, and that information is essential to properly treating patients. She says it's an essential job with an aging workforce which means that positions are available in the field. About the average age is about 55, so there's a lot of people who are close to retirement, and there aren't all that many people going into this field as compared with something like nursing. Speaking of nursing... Yeah. I'm going to check a temperature. The college also showed off its new space for nursing students, which is designed to resemble a hospital setting, and it comes complete with robotic mannequins that emulate patients. Your blood glucose went down really low. There are a variety of options for a student to choose. It's just a matter of the student deciding what's the right fit. I'm not really sure yet, but I'm getting I'm getting there. In Brooklyn Park, Delane Cleveland, 12 News.